What's up Gapsters? Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to show you guys how I create my Instagram Reels. I'm doing a transitional reel today, which I haven't done before, but I don't feel like it should be that difficult. So I think we're going to kill it. If you want to see how I create my IG magic, just stay tuned. set up here and ready let me show y'all the little details that I use to create eight all right so here I have my light my stands my tripod here for my iPhone that I'm gonna be using to record obviously and then this is my tripod for my camera but I also put a mirror right here because when I use the front facing camera on my iPhone I just feel like it's not the best quality so I like to use the back facing camera and then the mirror helps me see what I'm recording so that's my little setup so the Instagram reel that I'm gonna be doing today is a very popular one. There are certain reels that get a lot of views due to it being popular at the time. The way that you can figure out how it's popular, this is the original reel. And if you look at the bottom, by the sound, it has an arrow. So every time you see that arrow, that means you need to save that one because that's probably gonna get you the most views. Now also notice, when you make a shorter reel, it also gives you more views. I was kinda hesitant because I was like, this might not be long enough, but it turns out that was one of my top viewed reels. I used this from my story and I got almost 300 likes and then almost 5,000 views. So basically, right now I'm doing a trial and error. I'm gonna do another short reel to see if it performs as well as the other one. So let's get into it. We're gonna start recording the beginning portion. That's where I'm gonna do the snatch transition. And then when I come back, I'm gonna be looking cute. Let's get into it, honey. Make sure we got the right angle and everything. And we finna snatch it so, okay? I basically use this little timer mode right here so it can, you know, give me a few seconds to get ready. All right, let's go. could be a little bit better because it didn't cover the whole frame. So let me do that again until I get it right. So when you get the perfect clip, you want to press next so you don't lose it and then save as draft. Let me actually go back and edit where I want to end the snatch. You want to press edit clips and then click on the image. Just basically drag it to where you want it to stop. Which is most likely you see your full hand covering the screen. Like right there is perfect. Then you press all clips and then done. I'm about to go do my makeup. I'll come back and then we'll finish this off. All right guys, so I'm back looking cute, ready to snatch that so, no, for real. We're about to do the second part of the video. Hopefully we can get it on one take. If not, we just gonna keep trying it. <laughs> so remember, we're starting from snatch, okay? If I get this on one take, it's gonna be the best Instagram reel in history for me. Let's do this, let's do this, we ready. wrong with the video. I really enjoyed this. This was super fun. I hope y'all learned something from this video. Go on my Instagram, Gabrielle LeFay, so y'all can see the real live on my page. Let me know down below in the comment section. If y'all want me to do more of these, I will definitely do it. This was short, simple, and sweet, 
and I love making reels plus I get paid off of reels so that's where all my energy goes. Thank you guys again for watching. If you're not subscribed, hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you can join the Gapster game. I love y'all and I'll see y'all in the next video. Peace.